Well, we're back in 945. An exhibit at the Whitty Museum explores the story of Brackenridge Park through maps, photos, and artifacts. Yeah, this is really cool. Tiffany Huertas shows us how the park has changed over time. Up to 12,000 years ago, people were settling here, meeting here, gathering on the riverside. Um, and people still do today. The Landis exhibit at the Whitty Museum dives deep into the history of Brackenridge Park. It's mostly um, from the early 20th century. We can see here the, the bear pit at the zoo, at the bison before um, when they were on the land that is now the golf course. Chief creative officer for the Whitty Museum, Beth Stryker, takes us around the exhibit titled Brackenridge, San Antonio's acclaimed urban park based on this book by Lewis F. Fisher. The book is, and the exhibit are both divided into three parts. So the ancient history, the first people, the natural history, the, even the geology of the park, um, and then the shaping of the park and how it was founded, the land transfer from George Brackenridge, and then the modern park, what it is today and where it's going in the future. Artifacts tell the story of the area. But we also have two cases here. Um, one case is a natural history case where you'll see animals and plants that are related to the park. And we have another one with historic items, so um, an ostrich egg from the zoo. The exhibit showcases different images from the past, including this reptile garden at the Whitty Museum in 1937 to back here, this 1948 miniature rail line. But the exhibit also sparks the question, what's next for Brackenridge? This holiday season, explore the diverse layers of the park. The exhibit is open until March. Brackenridge Park is, of course, a treasured part of San Antonio. A lot of families have really intimate connections with the space, um, but it has a really long history. And so both the book and the exhibit dive into that history layer by layer. Tiffany Huertas, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.